welcome to my channel as you guys know on this channel sustainability matters and we embrace imperfect sustainability so I'll be leaving you some sustainability tips on how you could be imperfectly sustainable today I am so excited about this video because as you guys know I love vintage pieces oftentimes some people snub vintage pieces, others embrace them, but not as enthusiastically. I think they absolutely have earned their place in fashion. And so my goal is often to use as much as my vintage pieces as possible and not to get throw them out. So today, I'm going to show you how I personally modernize or how I make my vintage pieces work for me by incorporating modern pieces. Although one could argue that most modern pieces are definitely rip-offs of vintage pieces. So anyway, that aside. <laughs> but seriously, have you noticed that most designers don't come up with anything extraordinary or creative. They often go back to fashion of the past to get inspirations. And most times they often just, they just repeat it in a different fabric. Anyway, this is a piece from the late nineties. So it's, vintage or it's on the verge of vintage I think this is actually about 20 years old yeah it is it is over 20 years old so I love it when I bought this piece I knew for me personally even if I put it aside temporarily I know that I would go back to it to wear it again I love stuff with strings I told you I love stuff with strings right I do and so I love this piece love the details on it look at this piece guys so it is a flared leg details on it guys look at the pocket details as well and it's absolutely I think a great fit so the great thing in my opinion about this pants is that it comes as a set and yes I went I went above and beyond to buy the set because I got them on separate occasions and I could remember it quite clearly, even if it's 20 years ago. So yeah, this is the top. It has the same details, of course. And this is what the back looks like. And initially it had laces here as well, but they got broken, so I just removed. I removed it <laughs> so it had laces on both sides honestly it's pretty cool when I bought this piece it looked so cool and I find that even after 20 years or so later it still looks absolutely phenomenal in my opinion I'm gonna style it up for you today mix pieces that are in my modern part of my wardrobe and style them to show you how you could still wear vintage pieces without anybody even knowing if you if you feel the need to hide the fact that you love vintage pieces personally I don't think it's anything to be embarrassed about once I saw an ad oh you're wearing polka dots oh we don't wear that anymore it is so passe it is so 1950s we are wearing polka squares whatever don't make anybody vintage shame you or fashion shame you wear what you love 
and so in line with the vintage theme I'll be giving you some Mr. T today <laughs> you know me and my belt and bag you'll likely see these featured I'll just show you what I took from my modern wardrobe pieces to style these with. It's a good one, guys. for brunch with the girls this piece you guys have seen it in the last video believe it or not it's actually a skirt and I like to style skirts as tops especially in summer so I find this piece really really versatile and most pieces with elastic at the waist oh my god guys they can give you really really versatile looks and by that i mean skirts so i've been styling skirts as tops for ages <laughs> since i was a young kid a teenager i've been styling them as, as tops as well as dresses so this is one evening look i absolutely love if you're worried about that I have a video coming up to show you how to not expose yourself but you could still sit down and eat without any wardrobe malfunctions so yeah
stick could also tuck it in. If that's your thing, it has the option to do so. It's a rough tuck, but you could tuck it as cute as, as nicely as you see fit. Of the asymmetrical look when I wear my skirts as tops I love that look I find it so flattering on any body type you could definitely modernize it by simply giving a half tuck I really hope you've learned something. I hope you've enjoyed this video. I hope that this inspired you and it would reinvigorate your love for fashion. I love you guys and I'll see you soon. Take care of yourselves. Bye.